It's a world not many get a chance to experience, even though our planet is more than 70% ocean. Miami is the ocean, but yet so many people don't go out there and touch it and swim under the waves, or they don't understand what's happening in Biscayne Bay. And, and that, to us, was one of the main reasons to come here and, and really just to do something like this in the first place. This is Hidden World, a total immersive underwater multi-sensory adventure that allows you to dine under the sea without having to put on a wetsuit. We're trying to give you the opportunity to see the environment, to feel the environment, and to see some of the challenges of that environment in order to create the awareness. The pop-up installation now running at the Rudolf Buja Gallery on South Beach is the brainchild of creator and producer Daniel Hetfer, who brought this to life, collaborating with famed ocean explorers Ashlyn and Philippe Cousteau, grandson of the legendary ocean conservationist and filmmaker Jacques Cousteau. Immersing people here in these mangroves, into coral reefs in a way that most people will, will never and have never experienced. It's a, a, it's a whole other level of excitement and, and what we like to call impactainment. And you feel the impact all around you, dining under the mangroves or in the coral reefs as manatees and sharks swim by. The eight-course meal carefully curated to feature ocean-positive dishes that progress as the habitats transform themselves into space. It really adds a layer of, of complexity that connects you to these stories. We're eating invasive species, but it's delicious green crap, right? And we're trying to Again, make it fun, make it sexy, make it delicious, but also provide you some of the insights as to why you can alter your food choices. And making different choices to protect our natural world is what producers hope the takeaway is here. As the evening advances, you will see firsthand the challenges our planet ocean is facing from climate change, pollution, and overfishing. So we want to move away from sustainability and go towards restoration and regeneration. And that's really another thing that the, the evening is all about, is how can we eat for the ocean? How can we eat things from the ocean that helps the ocean? Look at the manta. Yeah, beautiful manta ray coming in. So come and explore the wonders our ocean has to offer and walk away knowing that it's not too late to turn things around. I think I want everybody to know that there's hope. Uh, there's hope, but we have to get our act together. Truly, at the end of the day, as Jacques said, we're all in the same boat. So we all have to come together and we all must come together to protect our ocean and to keep our beautiful land healthy. The world is an extraordinary, amazing place. We have two little girls and we want to make sure that they inherit one that is thriving. And that's possible if we take action. <laughs>